Okay. I hope everyone has been excited for this series so far. I know I, I've been loving it. But here's the quarry, part four. Is this a horror? Uh, so technically yes, but nothing, I guess, like, there hasn't been any, like, jump scares. But it's like a, it's like a, like a goosebumps type of thing. Is it too much? Oh, no, not at all. It's, it's more just like, what about the monster looking out? I mean, it's more of like a slasher type of like, yeah. But there's no like jump scares. If there's riffing body parts you like it. All right, well, <laughs> I'm gonna do my best not to get anyone else killed. Saw that stomach after. That. Well, it was a werewolf. So, I wonder. Yeah, I, I don't think that there's a way for me to, to try to go back and save. Caitlin, but I mean uh, Emma, but honestly, I, it's fine. I don't even care. That's not the way of the camera. I just looked it up. <laughs> Sydney, what are you doing, you weirdo? White noise. Do you have C6? I don't. Also, welcome to chat, DiGiorno. I did get. I, I do have C0 I find anything cookie, though. To eat. The kitchen's pretty cleaned out. Oh, shoot. I left my bag. I, I brought you this. See, I think because she's was... bit, she's infected now. I don't even know what happened. It was all just a blur. I don't How like do her, think? but I don't necessarily dislike her. Um. I mean, she has a crush on him. So I feel like her being compassionate would be... Would be more acceptable. I'm gonna grab an energy drink. Alright, well, you can join me in... You know, drinking one together with me. I'm gonna be compassionate. How are you holding up? I'm... Oh, I'm uh, playing well, from uh, his point of view. I'm just happy. You're okay. Are you okay? I'm sorry, I I, I just asked you that. So I... okay. Chef Academy. You're our sister in the back. All right, DiGiorno, well, thank you for tuning in. All right, they're off to find a radio or something. What's with the, um, the... Oh, uh, we found another in Mr. H's office, so... Just in case. Why did she get all oh, weird? What happened to the lights? Not sure. Any better? I'm doing okay. Kinda. Wait, are they going to the radio hut? <sighs> Phone's dead. They're gonna try to send out an SOS or something. We're holding down the fort. I wouldn't say anything. You never want to speak out. I thought you said Dylan and Ryan already left. Stay here. I'll check it out. Okay, so just just some quick uh uh what's it called? A quick playback of what happened uh at the end of the last episode. Basically the hint that I got, if I remember correctly, the the fortune teller lady basically said, remember who your friends are and trust them. So I'm guessing something is going to happen to where I got to trust in my friend's strength or something. I don't know. Welcome back, Power King. Uh.
Should I be reassuring or cautious? I mean, I feel like if we all stay together, Because I don't want Caitlyn to die. Maybe I should just say we'll be fine, just be careful. Ah, but but if it's something big, I don't want her to be caught alone. All right, I'm gonna be cautious. We don't know what's out there. Ugh. It could be dangerous. Yeah, that's why I'm gonna check it out. <sighs> Shit. It's okay if she died. <laughs> no. All right, here we go. I'm getting, uh, I'm getting ready for to to make some decisions. Let me plug in my mouse so it doesn't read anything wrong. Instant death decision. Coming for the wounded guy, not the healthy ones. So from the vision that the genie or the fortune teller girl gave me, the, the big hunter guy is gonna make, make an appearance. But I think they're the good guys because they saved Jacob. careful oh yep the monster looks like a hairless werewolf what I moved it that's okay see that is exact what what? Okay. Why is it not reading? I refuse. I refuse. Let me let me use my completely black mat and maybe that'll fix it. Now she doesn't have a gun. <sighs> hey, so this... Is there a way to go back? Why does... Does this game hate my mouse? Let's just replay the vision. Maybe on settings? Ugh. Modify the game from a selection. Don't breathe encounters will automatically succeed. Maybe default time permitted for interrupts. Choice timer. What's QTE? 
Press the indicated thumbstick direction or directional key within the time limit. Press any thumbstick direction or directional key within... Okay, maybe I need to just do that. Because it's not me, uh, reading my mouse. Uh... I don't know what QTE means. Cheetah. <laughs> well, it's not reading my mouse. I have no. I have no other. I have no other uh, way to way to do it. Yeah, I'll just do that. Because with my wireless mouse, I I think it's just not gonna work. It may not be like the best time per se, but like. What? Yeah, so like I was just, <laughs> Good. you know, thinking about like the start of summer and when we first met and started camp and well, like now that summer's over and. You know, well, shit, the, now she doesn't have the, the gun anymore. Other, you know? oh, sorry, Nick, oh. what, what are you saying? Um. I think he should be confident. Hey, don't worry about Caitlin. She's tough. I know. I'm sorry, Nick. I'm just distracted. Let's just get through the night, okay? Um, I don't think he should be bitter. Maybe I was misreading the situation back there, but I kind of felt like a little bit more was going to happen. Well, did you want a little bit more to happen? Duh, are you dumb? Hey. Sorry. I just mean... He's infected. And that means she is to too. Happen. I just didn't know if you did too. That seems like such a long time ago now. <laughs> Didn't want it to happen though. Uh, um, I, you can tell me. Yeah, I, I guess. <laughs> Just saying that because I'm hurt. Nick. <sighs> oh no. What is going on out there, Caitlin? We have time. We have time. It's okay. I got this. She's unarmed. Oh my god. What happened? Jesus, where's the gun? We gotta get out. No, we have to hide. Um Where are they gonna run to? Try hide. I don't know. Maybe they can jump in? Oh, release when it's safe? Okay, okay. So this is how you do the don't breathe. I've been doing that command wrong the entire game. But I'm learning. I'm learning. This is good. This is good. Everyone is still alive. Wait, I thought it has like an actual radio. I thought it was just like for your morning announcements. Oh, Hopefully yeah, yeah. losing the gun doesn't the get Caitlyn killed or anyone else killed. Um, uh, you know, I mean, it is still technically, but nobody knows <clears throat> their radio to camp anymore. These two, I'm very worried about. It's weird, actually, that there used to be kids with their radio. Nowadays, 
everything we need is on the phone, but Mr. Hackett takes it on the first day at camp so that we're not distracted by technology. Um, technology. It giveth and it taketh. Oh, no. So is, is that something, like, that you want to go into? Camp radio? No, like, uh, DJing. Or I need to make sure that I find all of the tarot oh, cards. Um, yeah, I mean, I like music, but I think I want to major in um, quantum physics. Quantum physics? Wait, what? <sighs> yeah. Uh, you don't really seem like a science Dude, it's guy. so dark. Oh, yeah, I mean, you know, not, not here. Gonna keep an eye out for the card. Okay, I bet it's in there. It's got to be, right? I'm I'm sorry. I'm so completely fascinated by this. What do you mean by not here? Not here at camp. I do that at home, and then here, I, um... You're a wise, wise, cracking smartass? <laughs> uh, that's a little harsh, but... Um... No? Okay, so maybe I was a little nervous when I arrived in an uncomfortable social situation, and I overcompensated a little bit by making a bunch of jokes. You played into it. Yeah, I mean, people kind of enjoyed the blasé villain. And do, do you enjoy the blasé, Dylan? <laughs> Not yet. Like, you know, whatever, man. It's pretty cool. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> um, I like Dylan Dylan. Well, it's nice to meet you, Dylan Dylan. I'm Ryan Ryan. Well, actually, I'm let's get the fuck out of here, Ryan. <laughs> yeah, I like him. He's That makes a lot of sense. Their flirting is so weird. Okay, here we go. Uh, okay, I'm going to explore. Just in case. My flirting is weird. Fair enough. Caitlin is number one. Shooting star. Ooh, is that something on the ground? Oh. Ooh. Something like that could really take your hands off. What is this doing at a kid's summer camp? I don't know, man. That's maybe that maybe that helped. It wasn't me. here over the summer. I mean, if it was, then we would have noticed that, right? Well, whatever it was trying to catch, you can't now. Hope. Okay. I wonder what would have happened if I would have just stepped on it. Or if he would even let me. Oh, Mr. Tarot card, where are you? really could be anywhere. So we're going to that radio tower over there. So I'm guessing... Room 05. I really cannot see anything. This is fine. Maybe it 
was pointing at something. Oh, is that it? And no. Diane, you can go ahead and take off. Oh, okay. so that's why Nurse Kelly went home early. Okay, you can go ahead and take off early today. The bus is going to be a little delayed and I don't want you waiting around on my account. I'll make sure the kids get back or get home without any bumps or bruises. Thank you for your Okay, I'll whatever. Finish looking at all this shit. Aha. Oh, what in the name of oh, do do okay, so that's the pheromone stuff. kept it. There's nothing there. I, f I feel like, <clears throat> yeah, like, I feel like he's gonna be the next one on the chopping block. So, but now that I changed the settings, I think, I think I should be fine. Goodness. It's, it doesn't look as dark for y'all, but for me, it's... I, I straight up can't see. <gasps> what is this? Please be the tarot card. Oh, man. I told the kids to look after this for three times all okay. they are. Why the hell did I do that? Oh man. I mean, it's a clue, so that finding clues shouldn't get me closer to getting killed. Oh, look, the door's open. This was uh, where we started out at whenever we first broke into uh, the little thingy. Any tarot cards? Oh? I think he's gonna get shot in the head. Dozens killed in fire. Hmm. Let me just check this last little part, but I don't think that there's anything over here. I think it's going to come down to whether or not he's able to use the gun and shoot whatever is about to kill me. Alright, so it looks like the tarot card has to be over here. I've looked everywhere else. Let's look over here first. Nope. Not 
yet. Aha! Huh. More evidence. I'm just walking into like complete pitch blackness. I can't see shit. Uh, nothing. Oh! What the fuck? Oh, so it's only if you're walking from that exact angle. Okay, well. Found it. All good? Uh, confident. All good? <clears throat> oh, this place is kind of a dump, huh? Okay, when I was a camper here, it was barely working. It hadn't been used for years, and it took me a really long time, actually, to get this place cleaned up and looking the way it is. So, <clears throat> I'm sorry if it's not up to your standards, but I've been putting in a lot of TLC. Okay. 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 Let me get this set up. All right. Anything over here we can use? The power tools? No. Um, that's... Mr. H wanted more storage, so it's kind of how he lets me keep the station going. <laughs> gotcha. So, uh, how far does it go? Oh, um, well, it was designed just to broadcast to the PAs around camp for announcements and to, you know, <coughs> portable radios and whatever, so I think the range is about a mile. Mm -hmm. I would say interested. How do you even know all this stuff? Uh, I just kind of picked it up. Hmm. The tech technical stuff has always been a little uh, hard for me to Not get a handle on. Well, if you like, I could show you the ropes. Like a class? Yeah, it's easy. Like climbing. Sign me up, teach. Anyways, this thing's going to be gonna a bit of a power I'm going to save him up. no matter what it um, takes. That's where this comes in. That's <clears throat> It's supposed to be a signal booster. It's kind of janky looking, but worth giving a shot. So, you can actually talk to people with this thing? Yeah, well, it's not a two-way radio. So, um, you know, we can talk, uh, but then the best we can do is switch it over to the receiver and see if anyone broadcasts anything back which is unlikely but well it, i mean it is what it is i guess yeah so it what should what i is. say uh just like make it sound urgent okay hello how's it going out there this is uh, uh we need help this is uh we are counselors at hackett's quarry summer camp and there's been a horrible accident attack, some stuff bad here. We need your help. Uh, there is a swarm of bears and they are what? everywhere. And there's these hunters too, and they seem to be shooting at the bears, but also at us, um, which is not good. And a few of our friends are hurt and um, we are in desperate need of help. So please, I mean, there's vicious bears and uh, we don't know what to do, so please, Oh, uh, come help us, SOS. Uh, this is uh, an emergency. S save our ship. Come on down, please help us. Yeah, that you good? Is that swarm of bears? Yeah. Herd of bears. Yeah, I've heard of bears. But... <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> All right, I, I guess I should just Why does like, that switch sound this like over me? to the see if we get anything back. Yeah, okay, yeah, I'm gonna keep an eye out while you do all this techie stuff. Okay, yeah, sure. <sighs> oh, 
should do be. <clears throat> I mean, we're in a locked building and we have a gun. We should be fine. There's okay. no way that I can screw this up. Wait, did he did he say lodge? I don't know. Hold on. Oh no, that's the the skinny hunter guy. Copy that. Um, out. But like I said, I think those two hunters are good guys. Obviously, I need to be concerned. Holy shit, they're talking about us. How? Cuz we just Hold them! On the fucking radio! Fuck! There. They know where we are, man. We can't stay here. Shit. Shit. Fuck. Hey, hey, Shit. Let's, let, let's stay calm, okay? Um, let's, let's go find Caitlyn and everybody, okay? Okay, yeah. Dude, if I were them, I would've okay. just went into, like, that secret room. Ah! Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Why did he not tell him that the thing was out there? Exactly! What? I was... I don't trust him anymore. He clearly saw it. What? I, I, I wasn't sure, man. Fuck, what the fuck was that? Why would he not say anything? Uh, Ryan? Oh god, here we go. Is it a bear? I don't think bears can jump like that. Fine. Don't shoot through the I don't think it's worth shooting. What was that? What is that? Fuck. What? Caitlin, Abby, and Nick, they're coming up the path. Oh, oh shit. No. They're coming toward us. We, we, we gotta warn them. Um, Open up the door and just the scream. PA? Up top? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, we can tell um, them to hide or something. Yeah. Or just open up the window. <laughs> shit, man. Oh, fuck, no. Oh, and now Caitlin doesn't have the gun. Uh, the, uh, oh, hold no. the button. Uh, Caitlin, get into a building now. Do not come up here. There's an animal outside the radio hut. Get, get, get into a cabin now. Go, go. Oh, fuck, dude. <laughs> They're gone. See that? I mean, maybe? Unless it was, like, on the other side? See, the decision at the very beginning to break into the hut was a good idea. Because cause now it, it was, like, open what for them to go in. The only thing is now Caitlyn doesn't have a gun anymore. I don't think being aggressive right now is because that it's on the roof. So I would just wait until it either comes up to the window or it tries to like break its way through, then you have a clear shot of where it's coming. Where's Jacob? Jacob went back to the lake to try to find Emma, but he's probably gonna stumble across her completely torn to bits, so that's not gonna be very good. But Jacob also has the pheromones all over his body because the hunter poured it on him, so he's not gonna be attacked. You should aggravate it so it stays with you.
that that is tr somewhat true because I don't want it to go after Caitlyn and the others because now they're defenseless meaning that if it does go after them then these two are going to have to run out and attack it but that would also allow them to clearly see where it's attacking from so ugh Aggressive or desperate? I don't like the the vocabulary that they're using. I would just say this. Is, is there anything we can do? I don't know. I, I don't know. It's just an animal, right? I mean, maybe we can scare it off? Uh... Well, it, yeah, I mean, if it has Caitlin. hearing, like, the dog, maybe, it, we, we can play, like, a, like a really high-pitched feedback loop and just blast it and, and that's I what mean, i was hurt, thinking like hell, but you know i've seen it in movies i would say supportive Do you don't want to go outside okay come on Dylan. let's do this um Almost. I would tell him to be calm. Hey, Dylan, just take a breath. I'm sure you can figure it out. Okay, yeah, right. There's something missing. I do. Always stay calm. What's missing? Fix it. I'll cover you. Oh god. Do it now. Go, quickly. Shotgun is just gonna blow it up, but that's gonna be fucking. Oh, was there? A... <sighs> Chainsaw. I hate this. Are you sure? Yes, fucking do it. Fucking do it. Achievement. The wire, get the wire, get the wire. What? Get the wire. The thing, get it. On it. Plug it, plug it into the thing. How did it reach uh, down? Keep pressure on. Uh. Is there an opening right there? What do I do? What do I do? The button, the button. Oh, we blew the speaker. It did the trick. Nice work, Dylan. <laughs> Ooh. 
What? Oh, right. fuck, my hand. Right, right. right. Okay. Oh. Just hold on. Why did you do that? You told me to. Oh, that was a bad idea. He's he's just fine. I think I think that was the best possible way. Is it safe? I think that was the best possible scenario. I would I would I'm I would be uncertain. I don't know. That thing's gone, but we heard those hunter guys on the radio. That's true, what? also. Picked up their walkie signal. They knew we were here. Fuck, you get a message out? I'm not sure anyone heard it. <sighs> Great. Yeah, everything's fine. Oh, God, dude. What the hell was going on at... Oh, my God! Tell them what happened! Oh, um... I'm okay. I, I, I mean... I'm not, um... But it's it doesn't doesn't hurt. Okay, you're in shock. Holy Dude, once that adrenaline up. runs out. Did that thing do this? No. Well, sort of. It, it... Oh fuck! Here we go. Caitlin, where's your gun? I lost it. One of the friendly locals wanted to say hi. Oh, dude, I feel like I hope. Fuck! Did she shoot at us? Wait, what? Oh, Who's she's there? she's hot. Oh my goodness. Who was she? Should we follow her? So the hunters are the good guys. She, she she's too hot and badass to be a bad guy. And she has an eye patch, so hell yeah. Anyone with an eye patch? I like him. Oh shit, Dylan, what is that? It's that werewolf thing, but I guess whenever it's dead, then it turns back into a human. And that's how the disease goes unknown, because they don't stay, like, transformed. This is a really weird song to play. I actually think that that was the pet the best possible situation apart from Caitlyn losing the gun. That's the only thing I'm really scared about. Oh, you're back. Looks like that's one less vermin in the world. Let's take a look once more. I got the tarot card, the hermit. Here we have I the think... hermit. Here, wait. With the hermit comes isolation, loneliness, but reflection, too. Perhaps given some thought, the hermit who gives chase can guide you to safety. But that all depends on your actions, not his. The hermit can guide me to safety. I want to show you more. Would that be all right? So obviously I'm going to see more, but <clears throat> yeah. So for one, uh, because the last hint said that I should trust my friends. And I think it was talking about that scenario to, to like keep trusting him with the whole radio thing. And then to trust the the black guy whenever it come whenever it came to like cutting off the arm with the chainsaw so so i think now he's now, now both of them are gonna live and i think if you use like the shotgun to cut off the arm or something like that or like if you said that you wanted to be aggressive then i think it would have gotten one of them killed um but with with the copyright songs so so even whenever I posted them to YouTube, uh, all three of them got copyright claimed. 
Uh, the first one I was able to avoid by just muting the one song. Then this, the second one, it started as a copyright claim, but then it got taken off. But the third one, that's still copyright claimed. And there's three different areas, so I was just like, eh, I'll just... I, I, I'll just let it be claimed because it's not like I'm even part of the YouTube partner program right now anyway, so it's not like I can make any money off of it. So I'd rather it just not be muted. Uh, but but yeah, no, it's 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 weird that, that I still got claimed. Uh, but can the shotgun go through the bone? It, it can, um, but I think with the shotgun, it would have been way too messy because... I think he would have shot from a little bit too far back and I think it would have just completely blown his arm into a thousand pieces, which I think that would have killed him. But with the chainsaw, I mean, I've used a chainsaw plenty of times to cut branches. So even though it seems barbaric, I like, I still trusted the chainsaw to cut through as clean as possible. But... All right, so what is the hint? Uh-oh, Jacob. Oh, there's an Asian guy? We spend so much time looking toward the future. It's easy to forget that the past holds secrets too. Worth remembering that. The past holds secrets too. So it's goodbye again. I'll be here. I'll wait for you. Would the rest of this chainsaw cause further infection? Uh, it, you could get, um, what's it called? Tetanus? Uh, so, at that point, it would just depend if he got his tetanus shot. But if not, he can get one after. But that's, that's the only thing that you can get from, uh, from Rust. Emma! Jesus Christ. Jesus <laughs> Oh, that was a ghost. God, this night sucks ass. <clears throat> Emma, is that you? Yeah, that sounded like Emma. And she would randomly say that. Okay. Here we go. I get to play a shirtless Jacob. But like I said, <clears throat> uh, he has uh, the pheromones on his face, so I think he's going to be fine. Well, they kept him half naked for <laughs> the majority of the game. Yeah. What is this? Yeesh. I don't want to fall off this. Uh oh. Interesting. I wonder. I wonder if we're gonna have to choose whether to 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 jump into it. But the hint was the hermit will give chase. To, to shelter. Uh, not necessarily, depending on where they're at. Well, that bodes ill. Fucking hell. <sighs> hmm. camera is this memory card ah huh. <coughs> maybe there's something on here
Oh man, because we already know that Emma's dead body is in is in that building. I wonder if he's actually gonna go that far. I bet I bet if she was alive, then it would be worth going over there. But again, maybe we'll get a choice to where we don't have to go over there, and we can choose whether we want to or not. I'm not going to miss the Tarot card. Oh my god. Where the hell is she? He has the pheromones on him. Don't forget. So maybe it can't see him as... I was about to just like, I was about to just hurry up and press escape and then, and then exit out and restart. Oh shit, there's a fucking bear trap right there. Okay, they're all around you. Please be careful. Jacob. Okay, okay. We already saw that this was going to happen. Um, obviously he shouldn't pull. He has to pry it open. Oh god. Uh. Uh. Because if he pulls, it's just going to yank. I don't know why he would pull. The only thing that I'm thinking is that if he tries to pry it open, then he might let go and then pry it. Fuck. Both options are bad. Ah, shit. Ah. Ah, ah. Look, you could. Ah. It's okay. He's fine. He just—he's just gonna get knocked out. <sighs> okay, Jacob's fine. He is completely fine. Is she like one of those hunter dudes? I don't think so. So alive, so that. Yeah, no, he's he's definitely he's definitely still alive and he's still fine. D I thought he was gonna die. Because whenever he was holding his breath, I was like, okay, what? 
like it's gonna stop showing red but then it came back and I was like are you shitting me should he have kept running but ah uh, all right uh Should I be compassionate or rational? I mean, there's clearly nothing that we can do, so... You okay? I don't know who that other girl was. I've never seen her before. Me neither. But her? Yeah. That's Kaylee Hackett. Mr. H's daughter? I thought she went home with her brother. Kaylee. Yeah. I thought so too. Oh, shit. So it is his oh, two man. kids. Poor Kaylee. Nick. You smell so good. Intervene. You all right there, bud? Maybe dial it back a bit, huh? Fuck off, Caitlin. Whoa. Nick, what are you... I want to taste you. Hey. What the fuck? Come here, huh? Oh, Nick, what the hell? Oh, get off. Oh, watch out. I said get off. He's gonna pull someone in. Dude, okay, Nick is infected. I, don't, I like I don't trust him anymore. He's clearly already lost too much control whenever he was. Hey, hey, it's okay. Okay. I got you. I got you. What did I do? Okay. I I don't know. I know. Abby's gonna be the so next cold. one to turn. Okay, let's get him in the pool house. Dry him off. <laughs> Try to rest. I'm sorry. It does suck that that we know that Abby's gonna die as well, but at least they can die together uh, as a couple. Quit so much. It's like Romeo and Juliet. It's pretty clean from what I could tell. I mean, it's not bleeding, but you need to see a doctor. I just want those three to survive, and then I guess I want Jacob to survive just for you. Never mind. Look, this is all I've got left from the nurses' station. Ooh, fun. You better hope uh, we find you some real help before they wear off. We need to be keeping a record of everything that happens. For the police. Yeah. Dead girl in the pool needs some explaining, huh? <sighs> Easy, man. I told you, you know, my Phil, mouse whatever we can. just wants to, wanted, wanted, like wanted to screw me over. I've got this crazy shit unless we've got some hard proof. From now on, if you got your phone and you see something, take a photo or a video or whatever. Yeah. You okay over there, Abby? Look, why oh, you look around yeah, Abby's you was the breathing because I didn't know how, how to how to do it. I, okay, yeah, you're right. I, I forgot about that. I forgot. What is she supposed to be looking for? I feel like the tarot card is somewhere like. Here, wait, what's my objective? Search for something to help comfort Nick.
it would be good to get the photo, but I think no matter what, it the game will still give me that evidence or that piece of evidence. So I don't know. I'm just kind of clicking because I, I literally can't see anything. I wonder where Caleb is. Uh, and I bet Caleb is the other werewolf. I think you could have had the evidence if Emma didn't die. Let me check. Attack photo? No. Oh yeah, I think you're right. Yeah, you are right. Unless it's... Um... Paths? Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Damn. Well, that sucks. Yeah, that's just the camp stuff. So maybe it would be worth going to, uh, going to the island as, well, Jacob's already captured, so I think it's too late for that piece of evidence. Tarot card? Hello? Clicky click. Clicky click. Nope. <gasps> Aha! Got it. I'm just gonna go into each one regardless. The way that they move is so funny. And back we go. This place was so different like 12 hours ago. having to send a quick text. Okay. Wait. Interesting. Yeah, I don't think there's anything here. So it looks like he's just kind of fucked. Here, that better? Thanks. Hey. Oh man, he is getting so close to, to turning. Yo, something is not right with that boy. Dude is real sick. Did you see how he freaked out in the water? Yeah, he was like, uh, 
There's like a fish out of water. Right? Uh, sure. You know, something was weird when I tried to clean his wounds, too, at the lodge. What do you mean? Well, all of his clothes were bloody, but I couldn't find where he was bit or scratched or whatever. He just kept moving around like he didn't want me to see how badly he was hurt. Huh. Mm, rabies? He's not frothing in the mouth. <sighs> I think Abby would beg to differ. Point. It isn't aquaphobia a symptom of rabies? Hydrophobia, it? yeah. But I think it's more about a fear of drinking, not just getting wet. This was like... Like my cat in the bathtub. <laughs> yeah. Abby? Oh, fuck. Yeah? Can I ask you something? Of course. Like me. Uh oh. I don't. I don't want to anger him. So. I feel like I should just be calm because maybe he'll use his werewolf ability to attack or to save the group from the other werewolf, and he'll sacrifice himself or something. So I'm still gonna be calm. Please just tell me. I've really enjoyed spending time with you this summer. Such a oh, such a such what? Such a cop out answer. What? Abby? Okay. Why don't you like me, Abby? This is... I don't think that there's good answers. I mean, I'm just going to keep being compassionate because even if he attacks Abby, she's already infected. So there's not much else that can really happen. Nick, I do like you. No, you don't, you don't like me at all, do you? What do you mean? Tell me the truth. I am telling you the truth. Nick doesn't believe you. What? You're not really very smart, are you? Oh, stupid Abby. Stop. Easy pickings. Oh, right off the bone. What the? This isn't you. I mean, this this isn't you. I... <gasps> Everything okay? Holy shit. Shoot him. Shoot him. Is he about to kill her? Shoot him. Back up the gun. Oh, 
Okay, she's fine. You tell me like a I I guess I killed him. He was going to turn I mean, anyways. Dead people don't usually jump out of windows and run into the forest. So I wonder what would have happened if the second time he asked me I would have been like apprehensive. Because they did like each other at the beginning, you know? So that's what that's that's what I'm confused about because she clearly had a huge crush on him. At the start of the game. Yep, and then tipped in the Yeah. I would be reassuring because she really did do what she had to. He, I guarantee you, if I didn't shoot him right there, he was gonna charge and then kill me. Abby, he was gonna hurt you. You were defending yourself. I, I don't. I don't know that for sure. I do. No. No. It was you or him. And, well, that definitely wasn't him. I and wonder what would have happened if I didn't shoot. Hey! I can't oh, wait to go shit. back through and see, what like, what these decisions happen? would have done. Wait, what it? I couldn't hear what she said. Who's there? I need your help. Please. Who are you? Oh, it might be the female hunter. My name is Laura Kearney. So? Don't let me in. It's not safe out here. Uh, yeah, there's a crazy woman with a gun killing people. I'm not killing Trust people. her. Holy shit, you... Trust Laura her. Laura Kearney? You're Laura Kearney? Yes. You were supposed to be working, uh, helping out in the nurse's office, right? And you never showed up? Uh, it's the girlfriend! The Max? Yes, Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Hackett said that you had changed your mind last minute. I, I think that we should, I think that we should listen to her inside. Open up the door. Okay. I trust her. I'm gonna open the door, slowly. Just keep your hands up, okay? Okay. Here we are again. Just oh man. Another one bites the dust. Why don't Nick, we take another look at what you've found? We, we loved your accent, but we did not really love you. The moon. How poignant. Tonight of all nights. To harness your fear and anxiety and turn them into intuition. Interesting. If you can do this and plan ahead, your cunning might just save your life. Now tell me, would you like to delve deeper into one of many possible futures? Interesting. So plan ahead. So I think something that we do right off the bat with one of the decisions is going to affect the very last one. So we need to pre-plan or like preset like a trap or something. Off you go then. Top top. One down, remember. It's not terribly exciting. Yeah, one down, but we just made another one. So, uh, why didn't you come? Where have you been for the past two months? We did come. 
one night early. That was our mistake. And one more on its way, yeah. So now we're gonna learn what happened after that prologue, and after he that guy drugged her. So something that we do right now is going to impact later, so if there are like doors that I need to unlock now, I should definitely do that. Oh shit, is that the boyfriend? Uh, don't call out. If y'all don't remember part one, I completely ditched the boyfriend. So he may not like me very much. Ma'am. This is gonna get a little messy. Oh shit. So why would he not just kill it? What have you done to Max? Shut up. Shut up. You can't just- Shut up! Shut up! This is an interrogation. <laughs> I ask, you answer. Name. Your mom. Okay. It's best to just do what he says for now. So. You don't want to try to big dick your captor. Laura Kearney. Who are you traveling with? And what is your relationship? Max Brindley, he's my boyfriend. Where were you headed last night? To Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You already know this. What have you done with Mac? No. I ask, you answer. That's how this works. Just be compliant. Fine. What do you want to know? Oh. Well. Ah. Uh. Why are we going to hack his quarry last night? Max and I are camp counselors. Oh, bullshit. Counselors aren't due until today. I told you, we drove up and got there early. We figured we'd just go to camp. Why didn't you go to the motel like I told you? Because we were, like, way closer to the camp, and we're broke. Mm hmm So I'm just putting on some uh, some chapstick. Again, you you don't wanna you don't wanna piss them off. So I'm just gonna be intrigued. Okay, sheriff. Hack it. Wait, hack it like Chris Hack it. Don't change the subject. What the fuck is going on here, man? You have no idea what's going on here. Not Why is he losing his clue. patience? You just stepped in some grade A double prime, go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. And your only option is to buckle the fuck up and do what I say. 
Do you understand? Yes, that's what I've been doing. Please stop trying to intimidate me or stop fucking around. What's what do I do I need to be a bitch? Like what 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 do I need to do? I don't even care. Please, will you just stop fucking around with me and tell me what the fuck is going on? What the hell attacked us last night and why did you arrest us, you goddamn maniac? Take me to Max! Right now! Hey, it worked. Don't lash out. Let's go. She's still handcuffed. There's nothing that she can hey. that she can do. Hey, you asshole! Ooh, so it only happens during a you full moon. What the fuck's going on? Max! I know you hear me. I would say concerned. Max, are you okay? Are you serious? You just left me to fucking die, Lord. You really <laughs> care if I'm okay? Oh, fuck. I definitely did. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> I mean, I, I guess I'll be apologetic. I don't know what to say, Max. I I was terrified out of my mind. I I don't know what I was thinking. I guess I can't expect you to think clearly in a situation like well, whatever that was. Oh, you are such a simp. Oh my I'm gosh. Sorry. I'll get over it. Granted, like obviously there's no way that she's going to be able to fight a werewolf. Laura but like yeah why am i naked but what? he got over it like that i mean after we got attacked the next thing i know i'm waking up in a jail cell and you're gone and now you're back again and and, and i'm super naked and there's blood and stuff everywhere i mean what the fuck happened he has undies on Maybe like in the the uncensored version, he's actually naked. And maybe that's that's like that goes into the whole like streaming filter thing. Uncensored version win. <laughs> I mean I might play this a second time through to see, like, if I can make better decisions. Yeah, so our host was very keen on getting me to confess, but I honestly couldn't tell you what I was meant to be owning up to. Jesus. What he used to try to get you to talk? The pincher? The blade? Three-hole punch? No, it, he wasn't torturing me. Who does this guy think he is? Sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max! What? Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry in North Kill. That's the town. Oh. And it Obby. gets better. I gotta look at his name badge and... Get dressed. 
What's he giving you? I'm not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey! Did I say you could talk to each other? Uh, it's better to be... I'll just be compliant. Sorry, see what sir, we'll be quiet. We will? Max? Hey, what'd you do with my real girlfriend? <laughs> the cop didn't expect this. All right, buddy. Hands through the bars. Because I don't know what this cop is looking for. Your turn. Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. We can talk right here. Come on. Hey. Hey. Let's get the fuck off. Come on. Move. Good boy. So you get angry that Hey. Fine. Stop struggling. Worried. Hey. Leave him alone. Yeah, leave me alone, asshole. Both of you shut up. Fuck you. I said shut up. Hey. Hey, you can't treat us like this. You're hurting it. Hey. <sighs> okay. Shit, man. I don't even know. Okay. Think, Laura. Think. There's got to be something in here you can use. Okay. Uh, let's look at this. While the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. Interesting. Says. <gasps> Brick. Not a chance. I need some sort of lever. Lever. Interesting. Oh, yeah, this ought to do it. Ah, oh, yes. Did she even check to see what's inside? It, man, I bruise easily. <laughs> Give me a break. Watch it, man. <laughs> hey, the second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Sure. Second you get out. Is that supposed to mean? Hey! What the fuck is that supposed to mean, asshole? I don't even know how I should be reacting. Hey, to you these. can't just leave us in here! Hey! Come back! Fuck! What? 
Yeah, like, I'm not too worried because obviously she survives. She does lose an eye, and we already know that the boyfriend dies. I think. I think that's what it showed in the vision. Are you okay? It's just a foot. It'll heal. I meant the interrogation. Oh. Yeah. Can't break old Max. Many have tried, many have failed. I'm being serious, Max. He just... He asked a lot of dumb questions. All right, I don't know. Would you get off my back? Jeez, I'm sorry. Oh, hey, did you get a look at his name badge? You mean it's not really Detective Dick Whip it? It's Hackett. Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh my god, like the Chris Hackett? Yeah. Who's the Chris Hackett? As in camp leader Mr. Hackett of Hackett's Quarry, remember? Man. Last night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean, though? You know? Were we set up? Maybe it's some kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's... I mean... What? I would say this. Well, I guess Sheriff Hackett's not exactly acting like a typical kidnapper, but he's not acting like a typical cop either. Well, how do you know how kidnappers act? Movies. I'm just trying to get us out of here, and I can't get us out of here until I have some clue of why the fuck we're in here. I don't know. What if we can't make sense of it? What? Well, you we have to. Sometimes things just don't make sense. What then? We're just stuck in a backwater jail cell for the rest of our lives? I would say encouraging. This isn't forever, Max. You, you can't just hold us here forever. You didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that. Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And school? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this fleabag fuckface stop me. Hey, there you go. We're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna study to be a vet, and you're... gonna, um... What? I'm gonna what? Oh, yeah, because he didn't get into college. I saw the letter, Max. What are you talking about? The rejection letter for college. I found it in your bag. You were poking around in my stuff? I can't believe you didn't tell me. I, I was embarrassed. But your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Yeah, it'll definitely fuck? play into it. Have you been making plans, Max? What the fuck? I don't know. What do you want me to say? Uh, I mean, she did leave him for dead, so... Can she really be too mad? I'm sorry, Max. This, this really sucks. 
half updated. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. You know you can talk to me about anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Okay, let's just focus on getting out of here for now. Great. Sign me up. We need to go over it from the beginning. Like from when we left home? Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into the... Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually, yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. The dude acted super weird when we said we almost hit an animal. You remember that? It was like he already knew or something. Yeah. Yeah, that was really sketchy. What if he's not even a real cop? Well, he's got to be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... Nobody else around. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially the whole hack it hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead, there's nobody there, and we get attacked by something, and then the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I, I remember the steps and a smell like wet fur and a. I don't know. A dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Yeah. Ian. I don't think it was a dog that attacked us. Whatever it was was big. Like, person sized big. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like, I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like, like, like I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. What is messed up about that is. Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. What? Hey. Okay, so weird question. Do you remember before we got lost? You got lost? Well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods. And you were all like, yeah, no shit, Max, it happens once a month. Yeah, so? Right, so, you know, full moon. Yeah. What if, uh... Okay, no, stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance it was a werewolf. Are you out of Goddamn mine? <sighs> Werewolves? Seriously? What the fuck? What, 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 what's so funny? I said literally the exact same thing. Okay, do you, you got anything better? I mean, like, zombies, aliens? Time hopping Draculas. What she's saying isn't far fetched considering everything that's happened so far. Yeah, like they literally saw their friend do that. Like. Ryan, right? Yeah. You want answers? I've got answers. Interrupt me again, you're on your own. Whatever. Would it really be so crazy? With all the shit that we've been seeing with Nick? Exactly. With that thing on the roof? Okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan. I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? <laughs> this is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are, those are just campfire stories like there has to be a rational explanation for everything for all of this okay you were not talking so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body you told me to and if it's bite with which your face to cleave limb from torso with great haste what you did the right thing see she's got a whole poem about it <laughs> There's more to all this than you think. Just let me finish, and you can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. Who she showed him her eyes. I think you should hear all of it. 
Looks like he was clawed out. <laughs> the next few weeks were long. Weeks? The cops kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot. As much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max. We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. Okay. I'm sorry guys, but I'm gonna have to end it there. So, a lot happened. Uh, network error, wow. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> so, in conclusion for today, Nick, or wait, what, what was the, the Australian guy's name? His name was Nick, right? Regardless, we lost the Australian guy. He was decent. I didn't really have good or bad opinions of him, uh, unfortunately. Uh, okay, Nick is the Aussie, all right. Yeah, so, unfortunately, we've lost Nick, and now we know that uh, Abby is infected and she will be she's gonna have to be killed uh so that's kind of unfortunate but you know and hey at least the girlfriend from the very beginning is alive which is really cool and my dog is attacking a water bottle right now so i apologize for the for the noise um but yeah so everyone on youtube i hope y'all enjoyed part four Part 5 will be coming soon. I will definitely be streaming tomorrow so we can get some more of this done. I hope everyone enjoyed. Whatever time it is for you, have a good morning, good afternoon, good night, and I will catch you on the next one. Bye-bye!